Hi, today I'm going to show you how to make a software training video using a program called APowerRick. This is the interface of APowerRick. It's free and easy to use. I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step guide on how to make software training videos using this screen capture software. We have different versions of the logo, which you can find on the site. Each with the same animation, but with different music. You can choose the one you like, and also choose another from the list, anytime you want something different. When the animation is done, you can pause it or keep playing it in the background. Totally up to you. A Power Rig is a free download of the software. You can download it here. We'll be using the trial version for the video. Just be aware the trial version is limited to two minutes of recording at a time and will add their watermark to the video. Installation is easy and I won't need to show you that. Once installed, here is the software interface. Okay now, with this program we'll also be using Windows Zoom which comes by default with Windows 10. In order to zoom in, we'll press Windows key plus the plus key on your keyboard. Press it again, you'll zoom in more or press that plus minus and we'll zoom out. In order to exit, we'll press Windows key plus escape. Okay, now for the program, let's set the settings. We'll go on top here to settings. Then under folder output, we'll be, this is where your video will be saved to after it's recorded. We'll have to set that. Then the output format, we'll set this to MP4. Resolution will keep the same. Frame rate, we'll be setting to 30 frames per second. Then under audio, it will be MP3 and bitrate, we'll set this to 128. Frequency, we can change it to something lower. We'll set mine to 44,100. And then next, all these settings should be fine we go to our hotkeys. Now under start and stop, see what that is, it's F7. You can change it under here, but we'll just keep it at F7. Click OK. OK, now on the main user interface here, on the left top here, we've got screen, uh, record screen. So here you can select what you would like to record. In our case, it will be the screen. Then we'll select from screen one. So you can choose another display if you want to, but I'll be recording my first screen. And the audio, we'll select the system sound and microphone. And then if we speak, you'll see there's some reading here at the bottom. That means our audio input is working. If not, you can click on that little arrow and go to settings. Then go to your microphone and select the right microphone. And select OK. And then next, let's make a, a quick test recording just so you can see how it works. So obviously, we click on the big red button here, or like our shortcut key was F7. So if this is in the background, you can press F7, your recording will start. And when you finally finish, you press F7, it will stop. Click record. OK, we'll just say we use the trial. Bottom left. Then there will be a countdown. And now your recording has started here at the bottom. Now once you're done, you can click the stop or press F7. It'll take us back to this menu. This one will open our video playlist. The bottom left. This is our track we just recorded. You can click the play button to monitor it. Or we can click here to the, the folder option to locate the video where it's been rendered to. Okay, now just a few notes on the structure on making videos for softwaretraining.co.za. We'll have a start off with a basic overview. Then we'll switch to the logo animation with the sound. Then after that, we'll switch to the actual tutorial part. And then we'll switch to the website and then inform them where they can find more videos and so forth. 
So like I mentioned, once you're done with the main part of the tutorial video, you'll go to your web browser, go to softwaretraining.co.za and then advise people that they can find more training videos here on the website. And if they don't find something they're looking for, they can request a training video here as well. Otherwise, thank you for watching guys.